I often hear people say that the Earth has no truly wild places left, or that some remote place like Antarctica or the Amazon is the planet's last wilderness. But I want to tell you that it's not true. Welcome to Sweden. In the next couple of minutes, I'm going to take you to one of the Earth's wildest and most enormous ecosystems. The Tiger Forest. Like a rainforest, it seems silent and lifeless at first. Big forests keep their secrets close to their chest. But after a while, we begin to discover some of the wildlife that makes its home here. The forest floor is littered with mushrooms. Tiny toads hop through the undergrowth. And a slow worm snakes along the ground. It's not really a snake, but a type of legless lizard. There are snakes here, but like all the animals, they are harmless, as long as we treat them with respect. High above, a willow warbler sings in the canopy, hidden in an unseen world of needles and branches. But perhaps the most beautiful spot here is by the lake. Sweden has many lakes, and this one is cool and perfectly still. As we watch a pair of water birds fly overhead, calling. They're red-throated divers, and they look like pretty, slender geese. This is a place to marvel at the beauty of nature, to explore and to relax. And as evening begins to close in, we head deeper into the forest. We have a rendezvous with some extremely special animals. But to find them, we will have to sit and wait and listen. Wolves. A family of them. They are no more than a hundred metres away in the blackness. They will not hurt us. Though they come into conflict with farmers by occasionally killing livestock, they pose little threat to people. They are part of the natural ecosystem, a piece of this wilderness. And what a wilderness it is. Though many people live and work here, nearly 70% of Sweden is covered in forest amounting to an area much larger than the United Kingdom. And that's not including its 90,000 lakes. And this area of coniferous tiger forest extends in a belt across Sweden and Finland through vast swathes of Russia and continuing on the other side of the ocean in Alaska and Canada. In all, the tiger forest covers nearly 12% of the Earth's surface. It is sparsely populated and extremely wild. It is home to wolves, bears, and lynx. So if you think that Antarctica is the only wilderness left, come to Sweden and think again. Look at that. What a beauty.